Japanese architects have unveiled plans for the world's tallest wooden skyscraper. The 1,148 feet tower, housing shops, homes, offices and a hotel, will become the tallest building in Japan when it is completed in 2041. Positioned in central Tokyo, the aim of the $5.9 billion structure, is to turn the Japanese capital into an environment-friendly city, and help transform the city into a forest, architects behind the plan said. Designs for the structure were drawn up by Tokyo-based architectural firm Nikon Sakai, but the building will be constructed by the forestry arm of the Sumitomo Group, one of Japan's largest business conglomerates. Currently referred to as the W350 project, named after its height, it is not clear which wood or woods have been chosen as the building material. The tower has 70 stories above ground, and is made of a combination of wood and steel, with more than 6.5 million cubic feet of wood making up 90% of the construction material. Nikon Sekei's plans outline a braced tube structure, that is able to withstand strong winds, as well as Japan's frequent earthquakes. As well as offices, a hotel, shops and residential units, the completed tower will feature a garden roof, balconies covered with greenery, water features and large internal open spaces filled with natural light. Brock Commons Tallwood House, a 174-foot high student accommodation tower opened at the University of British Columbia in Vancouver, Canada, last autumn, holds the current record for the world's tallest primarily wooden building. The 24-story Ho Ho Tower is set to top this when it opens later this year in Vienna, Austria, with a structure set to reach 275 feet high upon completion. Housing office units, apartments and a hotel, 76% of the building will be constructed from wood, saving 2,800 tons of carbon dioxide emissions over similar structures built out of steel and concrete. A rising number of architectural firms across the globe are turning to wood as their primary construction material, though few match the ambitions of the W350 project. New technological advances with construction techniques, and composite would make this a very exciting area at the moment, Ricardo Tassani, who designed a retirement home on Mount Fuji that is the current largest habitable wood structure in Japan, told The Telegraph. It is in many ways the ideal material, because it is a renewable resource as well as being somewhat recyclable. Before construction of the W350 project begins, Sumitomo Forestry Company must first traverse stringent Japanese fire regulations. Despite relying on wood to build houses for generations, Japan has largely banned the material in construction, because of its flammability, a weakness laid bare by firebomb raids on major cities during World War II. But officials have recently begun to loosen these regulations, Japan's new national stadium currently under construction in central Tokyo, for the 2020 Olympics Games uses wood in the design. For Japan, it is an excellent building material because it is readily available, it is pliable and appropriate for a seismic environment, Mr. Tasani said. Wood gives or flexes with movement in the ground, or absorbs movement in its joints. Concrete is rigid and does not have that flexibility, so it can crumble, 